Hey everybody, welcome back to another YouTube video. My name is Daniel Sunsword. Today, I am going to be showing you how you could change your Wizard101 character name. Now, this is a new feature that they just released in this summer update. Um, it's been something that a lot of players have been asking for since the beginning of the game. Um, most people, including myself, I'm going to show you guys with two of my characters today. Um, have been wanting to change their names ever since they created the character. Um, they may have had a change of heart with the name and it didn't feel like they it identified them personally. So today I'm going to show you how you can change the name. Um, one thing to note, like this is really important, is that it can only be done once per character. So if you change your name once per character, you cannot change it back. Please make sure you know that. I've seen people like uh, change their name and then they would email customer service or yeah customer service um, and request to see if they could change it back and most of the replies back are no you cannot because it is a one-time service um, thing so for me personally I've always wanted to change my storm name and my myth name to match my other ones so my main one is daniel sun sword my fire one is daniel fire sword life is daniel life sword um i think my death is right here daniel death sword etc but then my storm it's daniel shadow rider like what is that and then my myth it's just daniel it doesn't even have a last name so we're gonna change these up so what you want to do is go on the character you want to change their names i'm going to do my storm first and then we're going to go to the shopping district. An easy way to get there is just by clicking the, the crown shop and then go to the loyalty store and then just go to this character right here. I don't know how to say that name. I'm not even going to try. <laughs> so you go there, you should pop up over here. Then you go to the magic mirror shop, which is, um, where is it? Is it not on the map? <laughs> oh, it's not on. The oh, no, there it is. Magic mirror shop right here. It should be right across the dye shop or right across the hat shop right here. You go in, then you go to the mirror. Here she is, the magic mirror. And then it's just this same UI, but you just click this over here. Change name. Oh, sorry. My door just slammed because of the wind. You just click change name or gender. This is, you can also change your gender as well. But remember, it's a one time thing. Okay. Like, if you change it once, you cannot change it back. Click change name, and then you could choose this character may change their name or gender one time. This is a permanent, permanent change. So you could choose to change your gender and name, or just name only. It does cost 100 crowns. 100 crowns is pretty easy to get. You could do um, daily um, the daily quests like to get the this thing. Or you could do trivia online. I think that's still a thing. Um, and then you'll get 10 per... I forgot what it was. But you, 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 you could easily get 100, 100 crowns. So for this character, we're just going to do name only. So we're going to click name only. Then I could change it to my storm. Oh my god, Phoenix. That's my bestie. Um, <laughs> so we're going to go to Daniel. So you choose the name that you want. There's a lot of new names, by the way. Um, so you can look through. Um, but I'm just gonna go with Daniel Storm Sword. So, where's Daniel? There it is. Storm. Let's go to Storm. Uh, Storm, and then Sword. Let's see. Oh, there it is. Daniel Storm Sword. Then you click OK. Now, this is just like the same way. Um, if you were to delete your character, you would write. Uh, abracadabra so this is the same way to confirm that you know it's a one time thing so you would write hocus pocus just like that hocus pocus and it does say that this is uh, this is a one time name change and it is permanent and it does cost 100 crowns so this pop up right here is to make sure that you know it is a one time change and you cannot change it back alright but I'm 100% sure so I'm going to change it and then it refreshes the screen. And now my storm is called Daniel Storm Sword. Per. Okay, let's do it on my myth as well. Because Daniel is not it. Let's go. <laughs> I'm pretty sure if you were to change your gender and name. 
it would be the exact same process, but you would choose a gender and then you change your name, I assume. I've never done it before. I don't think I'll ever do it, but yeah. Um, okay, let's go. I know, I, personally, like, if this uh, feature did not come out, thank goodness that I waited for it to come out because I was literally thinking of just um, creating another storm or myth wizard, maxing them up to max, and then just having the name the name change just when I create the character. But this makes it a lot easier, so I don't have to do that. Um, okay, Daniel, where's Daniel? Daniel... Here it is. Myth. Myth. Myth, 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 myth. Uh, there it is. And myth sword. Come on. M and O P Q R S sword. All right, should be the last one. We're near the end. Oh my goodness! Come on, there it is. All right, it's literally the last one. Daniel Miss Sword. Per. Okay. Now let's write Hocus Pocus again. Nice. I understand that's a one-time and permanent thing, and change. All right, and there we go. Daniel Myth Sword, Daniel Storm Sword, Daniel Death Sword, Sun Sword, Life Sword. I've been asked why don't I change this to Balance Sword. I don't know if Balance is a new option or not, but I kind of, like, this is iconic. It's an iconic name, so I'm going to keep it with Daniel Sun Sword. Yeah, Myth Sword, Fire Sword, um, and then there's Ice Sword. But yeah, that is how you change your name in Wizard 101. Um, and yeah. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time.